Good morning, class, and welcome to Ms. Clark's Middle School Classroom, where you get a little bit smarter every day. Today, we're going to talk about a common mistake in the English language, and it is the homophone of the word there. A homophone is a word that has different spellings and different meanings, but it sounds the same. That's the reason it can be confusing sometimes. So we're going to go over a few ways to help you remember the difference and the correct usage for each of those spellings, okay? The first one is T-H-E-R-E. -E. There is used to identify location. For example, put the box over there or my group will meet over there. A trick for remembering the correct use of T-H-E-R-E -E is to think of the word here. If you cover the letter T in there, you will have the word here. Here also refers to a location. We will meet here tomorrow, or I will put my books here. The next example is a spelling T-H-E-I-R. It is a possessive pronoun. It shows ownership, as in that is their classroom, or their teacher will return soon. Another example would be this is my book, but that is their pencil. Here's a way to remember it. Think of the word heir, H-E-I-R. An heir is someone who is the owner of their inheritance. He or she is the new owner. Remember their, T-H-E-I-R, shows ownership. The third example is the contraction T-H-E-Y apostrophe R-E. It can be used this way. They are going to the movies. If you want to use the contraction, you're going to put an apostrophe in the place of the A, and you're going to say, they're going to the movies. Another example would be, they are my friends. If you'd like to use the contraction there, take away the A, add the apostrophe, and you have, they're my friends. Always do this test before using the contraction there. Check to see if the sentence sounds correct with they are. If it doesn't, then you cannot use the contraction. Here are some examples. You would not say that is they are dog or I live they are. Neither of these sentences can use the contraction there. The correct thing to say would be that is their dog, T-H-E-I-R, or I live there, T-H-E-R-E. I have a few samples here for you to go ahead and try on your own. We're gonna review them together in a couple of minutes. And what I'd like you to do when you're finished is go ahead and hit submit. If you have any questions about these examples, you can put them in the chat box. And what I'd like you to do is to go ahead and begin your writing assignment using each form of there at least one time correctly in your essay today. All right? Again, if you have any questions, go ahead and put them in the chat box. I'll be happy to help you. And I look forward to reading your essays today.